Hi guys, we just received our adventure challenge in bed book. What is this book about? Well, it's all about adventures in bed. We're talking sex, different challenges, different assignments, different projects that you and your spouse can do. Now, here's the truth. Most of us, at some point, you're going to get tired or you're just going to get bored. You're going to kind of get used to the same routine over and over and over again. This adventure challenge in bed book has so many different creative ways and things that you could do, places you could do it at, and it is very, very engaging. There are different genres, there are different levels, depending on how daring you might be as a couple. And so this is a book that is definitely a must recommend. We're gonna go a little deeper into it, just breaking down the different chapters and the different things and assignments that are of um, availability for you to do. And just one second, we need to talk about the quality of this book. It feels good to touch. It's about $35. We've seen it between the $35 to $50 range. I think we had a little discount, so that's what made it $35 for us. But man, guys, you could feel the quality in it just by flipping through the pages and touching the little like glossy print thing or whatever. Now, this book has some helpful hints. What these are, you can see little signs and, and symbols and whatnot there. It actually shows you what tools you might need, um, whether if it's an outdoor activity, an indoor activity, do you need to go um, somewhere outside of the home? How much money would you need for um, this certain adventure that you plan on doing with your spouse? All of those hints help you to kind of figure out um, what to scratch. I guess we'll go ahead and we'll scratch one right now and that will be the activity that we do tonight. Paperclip, bow tie, spatula. Yeah. For this ongoing adventure, choose a random code word. Okay, from now on, Either one of you can text that word to your partner at any moment. If the other person responds with the code word back, then you both drop everything and find the closest <laughs> place to rendezvous or rendezvous screw. Uh, <laughs> Am I right? I <laughs> hey, love yes. it! We're talking about sex here. Have sex. It may take a few times to make this work, so don't be discouraged if you don't get a response the first time. It would just build the excitement for next time. Nice one. <laughs> All right, what is our code, babe? Hey, this one is not 15 minutes, it's every day. This is forever. <laughs> forever is deal. Forever. There's nothing like. This is the best. Shy. But see, all these things are actually like all of these things, all of these cost free. Fifty dollars actually lies because if you were to get pregnant, um, <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna it's be a very exp anymore. expensive uh, rendezvous that we just had. Mm. You need to plan for it. If you know you're not getting, if you know you're not ready to get pregnant, you look Should for. I do this? No. So they should put an asterisk, is basically what I'm saying. They should put an asterisk next to all the price tags and Plus, then say pregnancy minus, might, minus pregnancy. <laughs> pregnancy <Press>. might occur. <laughs> <laughs> Rendezvous responsibly. Oh, that is 15 minutes. Oh, they mean the act will be 15 minutes. So this can be forever, but not. Yeah. Mm, I love that. Huh. All right. So what's our code, babe? Uh, I don't um, What's our code? Uh, no, if we say our code Because it can be in somebody's house Exactly So if we say our code, people will know No? Yes If we're having a regular conversation And then I throw in the word um, No, 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 it's actually a text message 
doesn't is it just text message? I guess. Either one if you can text that word to your partner. Yeah, anyway. so no problem. We can say the code then. <clears throat> okay. Let's make it even not <laughs> very disrespectful. Alright. My favorite word, Buddha. Uh-uh. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, right, that's a very respectful word. You said disrespectful. <clears throat> <laughs> Let's look for somebody's birthday. <laughs> How's that disrespectful? <laughs> That's disrespectful. No, it's not. That is not disrespectful at all. It's a word we're looking for another birthday. Pringles. 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 <laughs> uh, you don't like it, just <laughs> give that. <laughs> you no. But yeah, but you don't have to. You can make a regular word sound naughty, but if you carry a naughty word, cherry, cherry, or cherries, cherries. Okay, mm -hmm. not bad at all. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Goat milk. Goat <laughs> milk is better <laughs> because you're a goat. <laughs> exactly. Goat milk is goat actually milk. what we're looking for. <laughs> So we'll do goat milk. Alright, goat milk it is. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching. We will post more of the assignments this adventure challenge book assigns to us. If you enjoyed this video, just click right here for the video titled Overrated Sex Apps. You don't want to miss that video. Please like, comment, share, and click on the notification button for new videos.